Today we're talking about the moon, our celestial neighbour. It's full of mysteries, wonders, and it's always there, silently judging our late night snacks and wondering why we keep howling at it. With all the attention the moon gets, you can imagine that it developed a bit of an ego. Did you know that the world is about 4.5 billion years old? Scientists believe it was formed when a Mars-sized object named Fear crashed into the early Earth. You could say the moon was the ultimate party crasher. The moon goes through phases, kind of like your average teenager. New moon, waxing crescent, first quarter, waxing gibbous, full moon, waning gibbous, last quarter, and one in crescent. It's basically the original drama queen. Now, for the dark side of the moon. There's actually no dark side of the moon, it's just a side we don't see from Earth. The moon's gravity is about a sixth that of Earth's, so on the moon you could jump six times higher than you can here. It's like having superpowers without the radioactive spider bite. Astronauts brought back moon rocks, which are like Earth rocks, but cooler because they've been to space. They're the ultimate souvenirs. Better than any fridge magnet, that's for sure. When Neil Armstrong first stepped on the moon, he said that's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. It was probably the most epic look at me moment ever. The footprints left by astronauts will likely stay there for millions of years because there's no wind to erase them. Without an atmosphere, the moon doesn't have weather. It also doesn't have any smell. A solar eclipse happens when the moon gets between Earth and the sun. It's like the moon saying, hey, look at me, I can photobomb the sun. Now for something cheesy. For centuries a popular myth was that the moon was made out of cheese. This whimsical idea has been featured in various cartoons and stories, making the moon a subject of many cheesy jokes. Did you know that the moon has earthquakes or moonquakes? These seismic activities occur due to tidal stresses. Let's talk about moonwalkers and no not Michael Jackson. Only 12 people have ever walked on the moon, all of them from the Apollo missions between 1969 and 1972. If the moon had a popular census, it would be the most exclusive club in the universe. Did you know that the moon is tidally locked? This means that it's always showing the same face to the earth. It's like the moon is saying, here's my best side and don't mind the other half. Some craters and features on the moon have quirky names like the Sea of Tranquility or the Ocean of Storms. Even though there's no water, it's like naming your living room the Ocean of Snacks. Believe it or not, but there are companies that sell plots of land on the moon. Even though no one can legally own Lunar Land, imagine owning a prime piece of lunar estate with a view of the Sea of Serenity. Ancient civilizations had all sorts of quirky theories about the moon. Some thought it was a giant glowing cheese wheel while others believed it was a god or goddess playing hide and seek. In 1609, Galileo peered through his telescope and announced that the moon wasn't a smooth perfect sphere. The moon's reaction, stop staring at my craters. People used to think that the moon caused madness, hence the term lunatic. I can just imagine the moon right now saying, I just light up the night sky guys. The 20th century space race saw the USSR and the USA in a hilarious competition. Picture a giant cosmic tug of war, with each side pulling the moon towards their side of the globe. The moon is slowly drifting away from Earth at a rate of about 1.5 inches per year. In a few million years, moon selfies might need a serious zoom. Did you know that there's a bag of astronaut pee on the moon? During the Apollo 11 mission, Buzz Aldrin left a bag containing urine to save weight on the return trip. Talk about leaving your mark. Our moon is called the moon because it was the first one discovered. All other moons in the solar system have more exciting names like Titan, Europa and more. Talk about being the original and still the favourite. I hope you liked this video and please don't forget to subscribe, it's free and it helps us a lot. Till next time, thanks for watching and I hope you have a lovely day.